every other universe, Gwen Stacy falls for Spider-Man. No! And in every other universe, it doesn't end well. Ah, ah! So today, I'll walk you through how I made this cool photo manipulation using this image from the Amazing Spider-Man movie. I'm going to explain how to color grade and how to... I can explain everything. <laughs> Basically, I'm bad at teaching. I might miss some points, so watch the video carefully. First, I'm going to use the pen tool and separate the subject from the background. Pen tool might take a while, but it will look good. Once the selection done, I hit the mask button and make a solid color layer below the subject. Then double click the mask layer and start refining the edges. The reason I made a red solid layer below the subject is to see the refining results clearly. It's not important but it will help. Once that done, hit OK. As you can see there are some patches, I'm gonna fix them manually using the brush. Here's the background I'm using, it's from the Spider-Verse movie. Trust me on that. Let's flip it. Quickly resize this and erase the upper part using a smooth eraser. Then I imported this cloud image to fill in the missing sky area. And slightly added a blue tint using color balance. Now let's focus on the color correcting on the subject. First make a hue and saturation layer and clip it to the subject. Then go to this menu and select cyan. Reduce the saturation and then select master and reduce the whole image lightness. After that make a bright yellow solid color layer and clip it to the subject. and set the blending mode to difference. Double click that layer and do these adjustments. Make sure to hold alt while dragging these slides. Hit ok and see the results. It kinda reduced the overall yellow tint on the image. For the background this wall might look good so let's cut it out. Resize it and place it behind the subject layer. Then bring the lightness down and adjust the color using color balance.
After that, I'm gonna make a subtle reddish glow on the background, like a cool sunset tone. Once that's done, I'm gonna make a solid color layer on the subject and paint highlights. Then I made a bright exposure layer on the subject to paint some rim lights. Too much rim lights will ruin your artwork, so paint with subtle. Now make an empty layer and clip it to the subject. Using the color picking tool, pick a color from the background and paint very subtle on the edges. So once everything done, I group every layer and make a copy. Then merge that copy and turn it into a smart object. After that I do the final tweaks in camera raw. Or you can use Lightroom. Once I'm happy with the result, I hit OK and export the artwork. That's it. So here's the final result. You can find this artwork on my Instagram. And here's a task. Find this Among Us sticker in this artwork. And yeah, that's it. 
make sure to subscribe and give a thumbs up and i'll see you in the next one bye bye